Yeah, so I think. So, yeah. I think but, but the, the good thing about this is this prompted you it to prompted sort of that, think about. It prompted that, and it prompted that because my kids were leaving home. I thought I'm going to have empty nest syndrome. I don't want to be sort of miserable at home, sitting just eating, which potentially <laughs> was going to happen. <laughs> You've seen me. Yeah. We did Master Chef together. Yeah. You know I love food. <laughs> so I, um, I just thought I'm going to just. Do a lifestyle change. I don't believe in fatty diets. I haven't done surgery. I'd end up on botched. I know it would all go wrong. I haven't done anything like that. And I thought, I'm going to just really get on top of my health. So I basically, I gave up sugar. That was the big thing. And I know, you yeah, get, I, yeah, I gave yeah. up refined sugar. Yeah. And I walked. I love walking. Mm -hmm. I got really into exercising and walking and hiking and up mountains, hills, don't you name it. Yeah, and just finding an exercise that Finding works something for you. that you like. Yeah. That's, that's the what, key. That's what I do. I definitely walk every day and I definitely mm -hmm. yeah. eat. Love I it. think the most important message to send to women is just take control of your life in a way that's comfortable. That's don't give yourself you. something to fail at. Mm, exactly. Yeah. That's exactly. not the worst thing about this whole thing that we said at the beginning where Andrea said people are going yeah. on the beach and they're getting anxious. I yeah. don't look on the beach as somewhere to fail. Yeah. Because no. it's somewhere to You have, have to good feel one. good about yourself. You have to find what works for you. You find what suits yeah. you. You find the exercise that suits you. So yeah. that's what happens.